here is happy bite sas junction by rukboko okay where you have the salvation ministries uh, church along this rukboko road equerry road so this is sas road and uh, today we want to know in real time how many minutes it takes to drive from this sas junction by happy bite okay to the sas junction at uh, airport road by opm church okay where you are having the twenty thousand housing project and perhaps to know how beautiful or how the south road is i'm sure you must have been hearing of south road south road south road port hacker so today let's drive through south road and see how beautiful it is and also how long it takes from the south road rukboku junction okay to sas road airport road all right so let's go welcome back once again to the l housing channel okay welcome to this my youtube channel if you are watching this video just know that i care about you so much and i love you so much thank you for always watching our videos we are looking forward to seeing you watching more of our videos okay and also subscribing to our channel and being part of this beautiful family we are creating okay we are creating a family of investors a family of people who are buying real estate a family of people who understand port hackard a family of people who love port hackard and a family of people who know the look and crown of port harcourt and any day you visit port harcourt you can always find your way around okay because you've seen port harcourt from this l housing channel and you know all your ways around this city so if you keep following this channel you're going to know all your way around the city of port harcourt okay and the developmental process and everything that has to do with port harcourt okay so we are still going through on the sas road okay and uh, this sas road is such an amazing uh, place here in the city of port Harcourt. i'll tell you briefly the story of uh, sas road so before i proceed please this video is in real time okay i'm not going to fast forward anything i'm just going to leave it this way the way we're driving you can see we are not driving speed okay we're just um, uh, driving uh, gently because i want you to see everything to the letter okay how south road is okay now i would, would like you to comment in the comment section the minutes it took us to drive from big treat which is a happy bite okay on the rukboku road which is a sas junction at rukboku road to the other sas junction at the airport road okay i would like you to comment how many minutes it took so this is real time now the building you see by my right is the sars international market okay and uh, beside it is the the sars office okay you know they are no longer here it's now a police station here but we still know them this road as the sas office okay now behind this uh sas office and behind this international market is where we have our new town estate one of the first estates we have here in port Harcourt. and this estate is an amazing place like if you know michelle you would know new town estate because I've talked about this estate several. I've done live videos right here on this channel. I've posted lots of videos about this estate and I've followed the developmental process of this very estate right from the day one till this very time. Okay, so let's talk about SAS Road. Now, this road you're seeing was a track road way back, okay? As in, if you know Port Harcourt very well, before 28, okay, like 2008, this road was a track road. This location was a no-go area. As in, this road and uh, the GUAK road, the Elios, where you have the Nav Harmony Estate, all that axis before now used to be the, the den of the nasty things you can think of. All the nasty things 
in the city of Port Harcourt, you can think of this was their headquarters and their news. But do you know what? A man called Amechi, which was one of the past governors of uh, River State, okay, when he came into power in the year 2007, okay, during his first tenure, you know, every tenure is four years. He did that Eliozu Bridge where you have the Naf Harmony Estates, then the Giwake Road. Then he also proceeded to this SAS Road and did it. Okay, now this road is a major road in Port Harcourt. It's a major road. When you check the, the Port Harcourt landmarks, it's a major road and it's going to be dualized. If you watch, most of the buildings by the roadside are just not uh, good buildings reason being that these people know that this road is going to be dualized so you see sas road is a major area now here at sas road you have this place where you have uh, portland hotel one of the best hotels in port harcourt okay most of the celebrities in nigeria and even outside nigeria when they come to port harcourt this is where they stay and this is sas road and guess what we have an estate on this road and I have talked so much about the Sash Road on my YouTube channel about our essay called the New Town Layout Estate. If you check on this channel, you're gonna see lots of videos about that estate. Okay, now so this is Sas Road, a major road in Port Harcourt. And today we want to know the real time. Please remember that you're gonna tell me the time it took for us to drive from the beginning of this road, which is the Sash Road Rupoko, okay, which was the old airport road okay to the new airport road which is where you have the opm church where you have the twenty thousand housing project so you see this is a major road and if you have an opportunity to buy a property here at sas road please do well to grab it with your two hands because this location is such an amazing place now do you know what remember i told you that this was the den of everything nasty this was the reason why amechi brought sas office here okay he brought their office right here on this sas road that was what made this location to become do you know that this sas road now you can walk on this road at 10 o'clock in the night with your phone and nothing is going to happen to you like this location is very safe right now you can see there are lots of people living here this was a place that was a no-go area way back so can you see how an area can transform so like we that are into real estate when we bring an opportunity to you don't just look at that opportunity based on what you are hearing from people who are not in this field so when i tell you that you should buy from this location like i post an estate on this channel okay if you don't understand that location ask me then we'll talk there are a lot of clients who have called me and we've discussed about one or two locations to invest in Port Harcourt, the best locations okay we are the ones that are in this real estate we know these areas we know what's happening we know we we follow up what government is doing you understand so try your best before you buy your next property and sure you call me and let us discuss so remember to tell me the real time it took from the beginning of this road from happy bite to the end we are almost there where you are seeing this wire is sas road ending which is by the airport road okay so that's it about sas road i'm sure you enjoyed this video please do well to subscribe to channel, okay and i'm encouraging you to please watch our videos okay just this is what you can do to encourage me okay watch our videos like comment share okay and remember that i love you always my name is michelle modi and i'm that real estate consultant that brings you the very best of real estate okay see you in our next one. Bye.